Tools for Life is a series of workshop classes. It's 11 weeks in length and basically it helps with uh, basic life skills. Some people choose what they need and some people complete the entire series for a certificate. I left my country in August 2011. I left behind my four children and my husband. I was pregnant and three months later, I gave birth to my daughter Alliance. That was too scary for me because I could not speak any old in English. I could not hear anything that I met Mary because we was looking which person to show us where is the classroom for English. She gave us like all program at the Salvation Army. We talk about tools for life for English class. Chef James is a great community example. He has a family. He grows a lot of his own foods that he has in his restaurant. He's an entrepreneur. This program got started with a lot of um, single moms, you know, mom with one kid, and uh, how they could go to the grocery stores and get them out of the fast food cycle. So basically, how do you go to a Hannaford or a local supermarket and, and shop for about $40 on groceries and be able to cook at home, cook from scratch? Especially for families is uh, how you can go to the grocery store and buy $40 worth of food and almost cooked for a week out of it. I'm from Iraq. I came here 2009. I'm single mom with two boys. So I walk in and they saw Salvation Army and they say, oh my God, this is different. Maybe this is like modern church. I will go to ask and there is women around me and she say, we have a program, Tools for Life. Her smile stopped me. I feel like there is a lot of love. So I say, Khalida, we'll try. With this Tools for Life, they show you exactly. And there is like also a class teach you how you cook, and they bring like good shit. And we just take that off here. You just get your knife on one side of it. This is the one you want to be the most careful on because you don't want to waste meat. I love to cook. So after I took it two times, I don't want to stop it. And this wonderful woman except me, and she didn't say, no, you took it before. No, she's part of my family. One of the most expensive things you can buy on a regular basis is bread. It's always anywhere from three to five dollars a loaf. You buy two different loaves a week, that's ten dollars. You're buying it every week. End of the year, you're spending anywhere from five hundred to uh, seven hundred dollars a year on bread. Right away, we'll always think about the nutritious side of cooking from scratch, but it's, it's more than that. When you start cooking with your kids and you sit down at the meal every night, it's different than hitting the drive-through. There's something important about teaching people how to cook. Mm -hmm.